when I say y'all need to put some respect on these Amazon delivery drivers' names, y'all do not know the extent of what we have to go through. This is crazy. And it's more than just delivering some packages, y'all. show y'all as much as I can. There ain't no just pick up and drop off. You gotta put on, take the key out every single time you get out the truck, even if the house is one block, one house away. Turn and drive the car to the next stop. Sometimes it's grouped in, the houses are grouped. So, they'll put it it looks like one stop but it's like two to three houses in one stop some of these packages is so freaking heavy you gotta inspect the van before you leave out you gotta load up the van you gotta scan your cards oh my god wait until i show y'all the inside of this truck then they want you to organize everything. I'm gonna tell y'all this is crazy.
Here we go. Crazy. Oh my gosh.
ridiculous. Can't even find a freaking package. They got too much stuff in here for one person because they want to get all these stops done and people keep quitting because they got a high turnover rate because this is ridiculous. It, people are not slaves. Like, this is ridiculous. Yeah. Jesus, take the wheel. About to be the last day. trying to tell y'all put some respect on our name that's all i got to freaking say put some respect on our freaking names because this is so crazy this is so crazy
sitting there torturing these workers for some pennies. Everybody is up in their rate. So where is the competition at? Gotta sit there and break your back and do 50 million jobs and everybody else is up in their pay just as much as y'all. Why in the world should people stay here? I'm just saying, that's a job I'm thankful and grateful for. Lord have mercy. There's McDonald's, there's Chick-fil-A that's paying almost the same amount. Almost the same amount. And you ain't gotta do all of this to make this money. You ain't gotta do all of this. They want you to bend over backwards. This is ridiculous. Jump through hoops, do this, do that. I go to McDonald's for that. Telling you right now. I'm telling you right now. Them two heavy boxes in the back. Don't even think about it. Ain't no way. They ain't got no hand carts on these daggone trucks. Ain't no hand cart. Ain't no way I'm gonna be able to carry that to the front door. Ain't no way. I'm supposed to have a hand cart in every truck. This job is not for the week, I'm trying to tell y'all. They make it easy getting in. You got to pass all these tests to get in. Every day, for three days of orientation, you got to take a test. But they help you out. Yeah, because they want you in there to work. I see why. Cause ain't nobody else trying to do it. Lord, have mercy. Ain't nowhere stable to put this stuff. So if your stuff get broken on the way in there, it's not our fault. 99.
because we can't go through the back. Thank you. 
Oh my god. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. This is it. This is my Amazon experience. I got a chance to say I did it. I experienced it. I'm done. Yeah, it's time for a break. That's all, folks. this phone working for Amazon like you see my uniform you see you see the this? name tag you see this <laughs> you see this you see this guys see this? I slay this we slay this I we totally work. like carrying around heavy behind packages you know yeah and, and we get underpaid for it and I totally yeah. don't break my bag <clears throat> yeah wow. you see underpaid mama we work for Amazon yeah you like my uniform oh <laughs> yeah we get underpaid guys <laughs> Where's my $40 an hour? <laughs>